What's up guys? Welcome to another episode. Today I've been out walking Monty. He's been a very naughty boy and he's come back with this bad boy. A little partridge, a little grouse. I guess today's turned into a catch and cook episode. I'll roll on the footage now of him catching it but Monty's refusing to let go for now. So I'm gonna take him back to the car. Walkie's over. We're gonna clean this guy, prepare him and cook him and that'll be our dinner for tonight. Wow, so Monty's caught something. Oh, he's already killed it. Monty, drop. Monty, drop. Monty, give me. Sometimes there's only one way to get him to do what you want. You blow raspberries on his belly. He really hates it. Monty, drop the bird. Ow. Okay, maybe not. That hurt. <laughs> Okay, so we're back at home with the bird and we're gonna clean and prepare it. The meat that we want is here, it's the breast meat. The rest of the body doesn't really have that much meat on it. So how do we take the breast meat? We're gonna open its wings. Now there are a few different ways you can do it. You can either put your fingers down the front of his breastplate and rip the breast off. You can use a knife to slice down the middle and cut open the breast. But what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna put this guy on the floor Stand on his wings like that, and I'm gonna grab his legs. I'm not grabbing his legs by the feet because you can rip the legs off. I'm gonna grab them from as close to the body as I can, and I'm gonna pull up. This should rip the body off, just leaving the wings and the breast in place. So, I've done that, and it's pulled the legs off, which we don't want, and half of the entrails out. So we've still got some of the entrails here, which we'll just pull out. The head usually comes off when you do that, but it didn't this time. So I'm just gonna rip that head off. And there we have it. We have that beautiful piece of breast meat and we have the wings. What next? I'm just gonna take these wings off. Oops, <laughs> there's one wing off. Here's the breast meat. Gonna take the other wing off. Hopefully try not to throw the breast to the other side of the garden this time. There's the other wing off. And there we have it, a beautiful bit of breast meat. And that'll be a nice little dinner. There's still one shard of bone going down the middle. Depends what you're making. If you're making a stew, Something in a crock pot, you can just whack that in whole clean, let it cook with the bone in. Or if you want a nice little breast fillet, you can just cut this down the middle. I'll show you how to do that. There's a bone perpendicular to my hand. So I just want to slice down the side of this bone and you can see the meat peels off. It's a bit like flaying a fish. And there you have one beautiful breast fillet. I'll do the same again. Just cut down alongside this bone. And here you have another beautiful breast fillet. A little bit of flesh still on the bone, which can be taken off as well. Another little strip there. And really that just leaves us with that sternum bone the wishing bone is this one here. Make a wish, guys. Hope you wish for something. Drop me a comment in the comment section with what your wish was. Maybe it'll come true. And we can discard this with the rest of the entrails. That's great bait for crayfishing. And it leaves us with this beautiful breast fillet. It's not a huge fillet, but it wasn't a huge bird. But this will do nicely for dinner. Put some salt on it. And here we have it, two beautifully cooked mm, partridge breasts. Thanks for watching guys. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up. Drop me a comment in the comment section and subscribe for more. I'm going to tuck into this. Mm.